And the third actually thing that actually I like to emphasize, uh, you know, here before starting the surah is that in the surah and also the surah before I have been talking about one important thing, taqwa. What actually happening is, is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wants to Because that real Islam is. We people actually believe in the symbols of Islam more than Islam. There is Islam and there is symbols of Islam. People actually are more concerned about the symbols rather than Islam. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not reward people anything because of the symbols. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wants the real Islam from the people, not symbols. Understand this properly. And now look at really most, most Muslim uh, movements of the reform. They have got certain symbols. If you are in, use those symbols, you belong to that group. For example, if you are in, you know, I, uh, you know, I have, you know, friends, relations, you know, people, you know, in, in most of the organization, and I really, you know, I love them because they are doing so many things good. But at the same time, we also have to improve ourselves. So, for example, if you know Jamaat Islam in Pakistan, uh, Pakistan, India, the main concern all the time actually is Islamic State. If you talk about that, then you belong to that group. And the rest of the life, people are not concerned how to do. If you, if you use those vocabulary, do you belong to their group? How your prayers are, how your fasting are, how your life in the night, uh, how much fear if you have got thereafter, it is not such an important thing. As, if, as long as you use those, those symbols, you belong to them. In India, if you put topi, hat or kurta payan like that, you are Muslim. That we are concerned. So if somebody in, walks in the street without kurta pajama, so we don't think you know, he is proper Muslim. If somebody more pious than me, more pious than me, if he puts on trousers and you know, like in you know, Western dress properly and, and he has more fear of Allah, he does prayer more than me, but people still would think I am better than him. Because symbols have only can be Aula or Aula. I do actually you don't follow that, but many people think if you pray with a topi, it is better. If you follow that opinion, it's still just different will. But just think really, there are some things which is more important than that. If you pray with the remembrance of Allah Khushu, that is more important. If somebody has no topi, but he has more Khushu than you, that means he is nearer to Allah Taala. But we people more believe in the symbols rather than Islam. <coughs> symbols of Islam have become more important than Islam itself. We have made certain symbols, we are, they are part of our identity, our belonging, we belong to certain group, we want that. For example, if you, you know, belong to Braille, you know, guru, what is more important for you is Eid Miladun Nabi. If you celebrate Eid Miladun Nabi, you are from them. If you don't come to any prayer, it doesn't matter. As long as you come on the 12th of Rabil Awal in the mosque and big celebration and the 15th of Shaban and this and that, few, few nights, few days, so you are from them. If somebody prays five times a day in the same mosque, they have no importance for that person. These things have become more important for them than the prayer. Why? Because that is their identity. That is their identity. We have made actually, we have taken certain symbols, certain identity to define the Islam. Allah and His Messenger don't like identities. Allah and His Messenger, they look for Islam, not symbols of Islam. They look the real taqwa, they don't look for the identities. This actually understand properly. There was a Hindu in India, one of the Muslim, he gave him a copy of the Quran and he read the Quran. And then he asked him, bring me the other Quran. So this Muslim thought maybe, you know, he's more interested now, he wants another copy to give someone else. So he brought another copy of the Quran. And then he told, he said, no, it is the same Quran. And I want the Quran on which Muslim act, not this Quran. The Quran that the Quran of Muslims, the Quran that Muslims follow. Do you see? The, if you read this Quran really, and you look at Muslims, you can see this is not the Quran of Muslims. This is not the book of Muslims. We Muslims don't make the Quran our ideal. Every single thing is clearly our ideal. You can see their Sufis, they, their ideal is Ihya din this book, that book. If you are a Hanafi, we read a Hidayah, and this book is that book. If you are Shafi, we have our own manual. If you are a Maliki, this thing, and then we think this is fine for us. Who reads the Quran then? The word prophet of the Quran. Why Quran has come? Why Quran has come less important than any, any other book? Every book, everything has become more important than the Quran. If people want guidance, they go to this book, that book, but what Quran is, what purpose is of the Quran? understand this properly we, because we are basically more interested in the identity we are more interested in the belonging we are more interested you know in, in the symbols we are not interested in the real islam the taqwa party understand actually the many many people who we think they are not important in the eye of allah they are more important 
and many many people who we think really they're more pious because their topi or their turban maybe in the eye of Allah they are not so important because Allah does not look at these things in Allah Allah does not look at your shapes and your forms Allah looks at your hearts he looks in the hearts of the people he does not look at the forms of people you know how, how they look he looks at the, what in their heart and then the Quran said in Allah when you make a sacrifice of an animal, so the blood of the animals or the meats of the animal, they don't go to the heaven, to Allah. What goes is your fear of Allah. So you know that that's what matters.